See, this is why you have 20 foot RV, you can park anywhere. Hey, how many feet is that? Huh? Uh, 15 feet. 15? 15, yes. That's where you can park anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Roam around. No, we, we are going now. No, I, I, I cannot fit there. I'm 30. Okay. Uh, somewhere over there. This is Mission Church, and it looks like it's active. And because everything is so tight, I found a spot here to park. Mission San Carlos Baromeo del Rio Carmelo. First built in 1797, is the most authentically restored. It's the second in order built and it uh, served as a center for mission operation for all missions and Father Junipero Serra was living here. So he started from San Diego and came up here and stayed here. 200 years before Carmel became one of the world's most famous tourist destinations, it was an important religious center. This history is preserved in the Mission San Carlos Borromeo del Rio Carmelo, better known as the Carmel Mission. The Carmel Mission, founded in 1771, was headquarters for Alta California's missions and was also home to Father Junipero Serra, the founding president of the missions. There are 21 missions in California. They are simple, massive structures built about a day's walk from one another. They were meant to spread the word of God to the Indians as well as to expand Spanish rule and create new citizens. Each mission was like a small, self-sufficient city in itself, a beehive of activity. The mission bells would wake them at 6 a.m. Prayer and breakfast were followed by work that lasted well into the evening. The fathers were responsible for running the mission and instructing the Indians and their children in the Catholic faith. The men worked the surrounding ranches and built the buildings while the women made clothes and food. The fathers lived in simple rooms that looked very much like jail cells. Father Sarah himself lived in a tiny cell that included a bed with a mattress made of straw, a single blanket, a table, and a candlestick. The missionaries took a vow of poverty and the living quarters at the mission were simple. The cemetery. And Father Junipero Serra is buried somewhere here. Not in a cemetery, I think at a special place. That was his desire to be buried here. This is in memory of the Christian Indian, Indians and Spaniards. This is unique bell tower with nine bells. This is the garden inside the mission. And uh, what's interesting is these trees, you can see that they are huge. Every couple hundred years, if not more. So the church was almost destroyed after Mexican secularization. Even the roof tiles people took and used for their own homes. Later, it was restored and uh, they kept the 
same original concept for the roof 